Hey guys, welcome to the UF Disciple channel. Today we have another episode of my Will It Play series. We're going to see how well the Intel HD 530 can play World of Warships. So let's get started. Before we go over the benchmark results, let's go over the specifications of my system first. For the processor, I have an Intel Core i7-6700K overclocked to 4.4 GHz with 32 GB of DDR4, 2133 MHz RAM with the Intel HD 530 graphics unit. For the benchmarks with World of Warships, I ran the game at a 1920x1080 resolution with the graphics presets of very high, high, medium, and low and recorded the minimum, maximum, as well as average frame rates for each of these settings. As the chart details, the game could average 30 FPS at the high graphics settings or lower. And while the numbers may not tell the story, at very high, the game was not too bad to play. Since it's more of a slow moving game, the dip into lower frame rates didn't make it seem like the action was stuttering at all. So will the Intel HD 530 play World of Warships? The answer is yes. You can skip the graphics card for this game and still enjoy playable frame rates and beautiful graphics. So that's it for this episode of Will It Play. Subscribe if you want to stay up to date on future episodes of Will It Play, as well as other tech-related videos that I produce. Like this video if you found it helpful. Dislike it if it was more disappointing than the Chicago Cubs, which just got swept by the Mets. Also, please left a, leave a comment down below with any suggestions for other games you want me to test or other integrated graphic systems you want me to check out for future episodes of Will It Play. And if you're looking to watch more of my stuff, my content, you can click the card in the top right-hand corner to check out my Skylake build project where I put the i7-6700K and all of the components together. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Cheers.